welcome back to a new episode of Mafia Definitive Edition. Hey, boss. They came as soon as I got your message. Sit down, Tom. We have a mole, Tom. No. Who? Oh. I was up all night driving myself nuts trying to figure it out. I started thinking maybe it's one of our guys. We aren't paying his fair share. Someone with a light wallet. Maybe looking to Morello for a new suit. Frank wasn't around, so I went to the safe to get the account books. To see who's getting cents on the dollar he's earned. What do you know? The books are gone, Tom. Frank. <sighs> More than 50 years I've known him. <sighs> Everything I have, I got with Frank. And every buck we've earned, every dime we've paid out, it's all logged in those books. Frank hands those over to the feds, we're finished. Frank respects one person in this whole town, and that's you. This has got to be some kind of misunderstanding. I've been calling him all day. I went by his place. He's gone. His wife and kid are gone. But why? I don't know. I'm sure he has his reasons. Maybe he's still smarting over the dog. But when you tried to drown? Yeah. <sighs> Same one I shot after he wouldn't let me sink her. I was a stupid kid, Tommy. But grudge or no grudge, we gotta get those books back. Shake down all our stories. See who knows what. When you catch up to Frank, you get those books. And if he doesn't have them on him, you make him tell you where to find them. After that, you do what we gotta do. Vincenzo's waiting for you with a clean car. Feds get those books, our whole operation's at risk. Morello's wrapped up in all this. I just know it. Tough day today, Tom. We gotta keep a lid on this, Tom. Start with Biff, but don't give him nothing. I got you a clean set of wheels and some special here if you want it. Of course I do. Is that a shotgun? Frank sees a Lapara, he'll know. It always work. I didn't see this coming out from Frank. Is that a road? Oh, okay, that oh down there. Okay, yeah, right here. Tommy, what's the rumpus? Heard any big news lately? 
Something that Don might want to know. Uh, it depends. <laughs> What's it worth to you? 20 bucks. How about 40? All right, spill. The FBI is in town. They're getting something from Morello, but I, I don't know what. How'd you hear? Little Tony got some guy drunk in the black cat and drove him home. Heard a bunch of stuff, so he's the guy you want to see. Okay. Thanks. The FBI is Always not good. Don't want to hit the cop. It's a much better parking job than my last time where I just parked it on the sidewalk. Everything okay, Tom. Um, let's go. Oh, there we go. It's not. What's this about the guy you drove home who's with the feds? He came in for a drink, which turned into ten. He's hired muscle for some kind of safe house. Where? Oak Hill, corner of Pine. He gave me ten bucks to drive him back and keep my mouth shut. That on that Councilor Gilatis brokered some kind of deal between Morello and the FBI. They were all ready to sit tight on someone in there. Why the hell didn't you tell us? Tom, I did. I came in to see Frank straight away. He didn't tell the Don? No. No, he didn't. Tom? What's going on? Okay, I guess we're not going to answer his question. Kind of rude, but... Maybe he doesn't need to know. But then again, I don't even really know. I just know the FBI is in town, and that is not a good thing. Okay, we gotta turn around here because we need the bridge, it looks like. And it's gonna be right up here. Looks like the place. Take me to those account books, Frank. And we return now to cover what could be the final play of this game and the series between the Lost Heaven Lancers and the Empire Bay Cannons. A quick reminder that this final... Stay back, we don't want to get spotted. Although the video game logic of tailing people is kind of flawed because he looked more suspicious by hanging super far back like this. Like this. That truck looks familiar. It's the same model that we used in the um, previous episode. 
when I kept dying. Doing a good job here staying nice and far back. I've only seen the meter fill a little bit once. But I'm watching the car, I'm watching the road, I'm watching the meter. I'm like looking at three things at once here. Oh, shit. They're taking you to the airport, Frank. It's funny, I was closer there than I was before when I saw the meter fill up. We're going way out again. Way out in the middle of nowhere. The little icon thing up above the car has disappeared. Is that because we're too far back? Try and close this gap up a little bit here. There we go. Now nah, it's back. Getting a little nervous there. Thought I screwed it up for a second. I would do that. It'd be quite obvious at this point that we're actually following him, but... Okay. They're gonna be completely oblivious to everything. Christ. They're flying him out of state or something. Fuck. This ain't good. I'll park the car in a hidden location, like over here. There we go. Like, what am I supposed to do? Excuse me. Oh. Lights will be canceled. I'm sure of it. I like sneak in over here or something. How do I? There we go. We got a problem here. We got a problem here. Can't hide from me. We got a problem here. Hey, don't give me here. Taking cover. 
I, I mean, am I supposed to be shooting people? Like, I don't know. Okay, oh, just made it. Tom. Frank. The Don sent me. I figured as much. I'm sorry it had to be you, Tommy. Anything you want me to tell him? I wish it could have shaken out better, but Morello finally came after me. It's okay. You can come out. Morello offered me a simple trade. The Don's account books for our lives and tickets out of this town. You hand the books over, you... I'm not so stupid, Don. They're safe. Morello was waiting for this. It's a key to a box in the Grand Imperial Bank downtown. I told Morello I'd hand it over after the plane was fueled and ready to go. His men were meant to fetch it before we left. I took care of him. Told him to get on a plane. Go on, March. Alice, get aboard. Frank, you're coming with us. Not right now, honey. Just get buckled in. Tommy and I, we have some serious business to discuss. But Frank... Get on the plane, March. For Alice. For me. Get on the goddamn plane. Please. You been paid yet? Yeah. Now you've been paid twice. You take the ladies wherever they want to go. Yes, sir. Thank you, Tom. Christ, Frank. Why didn't you ask us for help? I guess I just wanted out. One way or the other. I'm tired, Tommy. Tired of lying to my wife. Tired of checking under my car every time I take a Sunday drive. And tired of waiting for the dawn to put two in my temple. That could come back to hurt us, though, I feel like. It's the good thing to do, but, like, it could possibly hurt us. See, I just didn't know back there if I was supposed to just, like, sneak through the airport, or... Go in, like, guns blazing, killing everyone. I kind of wanted to just, like, sneak through, because I'd rather do stealth than guns blazing, but... That just didn't really... work. Good afternoon, sir. Where's the safety deposit boxes? With my colleague downstairs, sir. Thanks. Oh. I thought it said, like, on that thing was where the little emblem thing was. Beautiful day, huh? 
Trouble, I hope. I need to access the deposit boxes for Frank Coletti. Ah, yes, Mr. Angelo? Uh, yeah. Mr. Coletti said it might be you who came and to provide access. Please, follow me. Got the books and covered my tracks. Salieri never asked any questions. In fact, apart from the funeral, I never heard him talk about Frank again. Making my boys twitchy, Marku. Sergio and I just came by to pay respects, that's all. Known Frank a long time. Almost as long as you. He's a good man. Smart. Loyal. <laughs> Loyal to his wife. His kid above all else. There must be some kind of honor in that in you. Maybe. But I'm still looking at this headstone with his little girl's name on it. Chapter complete. Visiting Rich People, 1933. Look at these houses. Big yards, white picket fences. It's the American dream, eh, Tommy? I suppose. Not for you? No, sir. I don't like being closer to the business. Don't let the flower beds and front porches fool you. There's more criminals out here than in the rest of the city combined. Are that why we're in the neighborhood? In a way. Merle's got a dirty prosecutor on his payroll named Watkins. Turns out he's old friends with Galati. The city councilor? The same. Morell let drop that we might have had something to do with the Galati boy's death. Now Watkins is loaded for bear, trying to do right by his buddy. Word is, he's striking gold with a few witnesses. You have names? Yeah. But Paulie and Sam are taking care of them. I'm putting you on a different part of the job. We need whatever Watkins has got on us. Well, where's he holding? A safe in his villa. <laughs> I'm no safe cracker. <laughs> Don't worry about that. We're taking you to meet Salvatore. He's fresh off the boat, but he knows how to pop open anything. Just get him into the villa, find the safe, and he'll do the rest. What kind of rumpus should I expect? Nothing you can't handle. Watkins is going to the theater, so the house should be empty except for a bit of muscle. The office is on the first floor, and our stoolie says the safe is in the wall. Once Salvatore has the safe open, grab all the evidence and get out. That him, boss? Yeah, that's our guy. Salvatore, tutto bene? Si, grazie. Don Salieri. Good to see you. You know the job. Don't let me down. See, si. who capisce you? Tommy, if you bump into Watkins, don't kill him. It'll just bring down more heat. You got it, boss. Buona fortuna, ragazzi. Tommy, Tommy Angelo. Piacere, dear. The 
conosciuti. Meraviglioso. <ride> Più favori. Well, I was gonna say they should have somebody tell Watkins so if he comes back, we would know, but they would have no way to tell us because this is the 1930s, so cell phones don't exist. I don't speak Italian. Excellente. Fantastico. Uh, no plan? Yeah, the bus told me. Uh, please, uh, uh, understand. Entriamo dal laberinto senza farci sentire né vedere. La cassaforte è dietro un dipinto al primo piano. Dammi un po' di tempo e lascia fare tutto a me. Quella cassaforte avrà sicuramente un allarme. Uh, yeah. This is going to be a long night for the both of us. Ah, Cristo Santo. Okay, my turn. Do what I do. Do not get caught. Si. You gotta keep safe. Safe? Si. Uh, it's um, uh, my job. Apro casa forte. Open safe. Christ. Okay. Radio. Let's listen to the radio. Excellente. I have a feeling this guy's not going to be much help if the bullets start flying. Which is probably what's going to happen. Oh. Right here. Actually, let me back a little bit. Oh, I mean, this should be fine. I think it's that, yeah, up there. Oh, I, I keep trying to use Grand Theft Auto controls. I don't know why. Stay here while I take out the guards. Now how do I get out of cover? Okay. How do I change weapons? Where is this guy? Oh, it's like a maze thing. Not amazing, it's a maze thing. over there but how do we get over there then okay I see him now which way is he facing I thought he's going that way
I just like go up and over now. Okay, so there's a guy back over on the left, and then there's like, one up ahead. Crouch. Come on. Okay, I see this guy. Oh, there we go. I was using the wrong stick. I was using the left stick to try to crouch, but it's the right one. Okay. There was one other guy. He's up in the he's up in the front. How do I get through though? Well isn't that convenient? Night night. Is that all of them? Oh, that was all of them. What's this red thing over here? Oh, there's some uh, something over here. Oh, ah, okay, I see him. Night, night. See, the thing is, they don't show up on the map, so I don't really know where to go. Just take them out. Like, it looks like I got them all, but I don't. Oh, okay. I can't tell which way he's facing. Night night. Think that's all of them. Yes. Salvatore. Where are you? We're clear. Tommy, I hear. Okay. Where the hell did he go? Guys are pain in the ass. Uh huh. Tommy, I hear. Oof. Sei un tipo tosto, eh? What? Hey, come on, let's go. Open. Kick. What kind of luck picker are you? 
look for a dipinto. A what? Ma, um, da Vinci, uh, Caravaggio, uh, I capito. Painting? You're saying it's behind the painting? Si, si. Okay, I understand. Non quello. Guess we got another room to check. What's this over here? Oh, is that just another door? Yeah. So that was surprisingly easier getting in. I feel like getting out's gonna be an issue, especially since he mentioned not to kill him if we come across him. So I feel like we're probably gonna come across him. Empire Bay mob boss murdered. Spectacular pictures of Vile Vil Vil Kingpin's fiery end. Notorious racketeer Tommaso Moretti was killed outside his Empire Bay residence last Thursday afternoon. The sole victim of a car bomb, undoubtedly planted by an underworld rival. Bay residents will hope that Mortelli's Death brings to an Moretti's death brings to an end that the spate the spate of gang violence that has cracked that has rocked their city in recent months. Few will mourn his passing. Okay, now let's check the picture. Can I take that gun though? I guess not. So wait, yeah, that was, yeah, everything in there. That's back out there. Okay, we can't go there. Again, okay, that's going to be back out into the entrance there. Stay out of our way and you won't get hurt. Oh, I did the maids in here. I didn't, I didn't see her when I first came in. Gotta be it. Does it? This last room? Yeah, they're still upstairs. Nothing again. That's just back in where we were. Now we need to be out here to go up the stairs. Let's see, no pictures. It's a door though. There's one. Oh. Nope. You sure it's behind one of these, Salvatore? And there's nothing out here. I don't want her like calling anyone. I don't really want to kill her either, but like 
She's like running around screaming that there's burglars. I don't know if she's gonna like alert anyone. There's a picture, but I guess we can't do anything with that. Nothing. I mean, I kind of you know, feel bad though if she couldn't do anything. What was that? I'm beginning to think it's not behind a painting. It's a good thing the doors don't reclose though, because that'd be That'd be annoying. Prosecutor Watkins, I am writing to thank you. If you can truly give us reliable witness testimonies and evidence that Saleri has had Billy killed, I'll be in your debt. The pre-story never rang true, and now he's dead and buried. This feels like our last throw of the dice. If witnesses ask for too high a price, I will cover it. Likewise, our mutual friend will be able to apply some pressure. Stamping out Saliri and his family will be good for us all. These are dangerous times. I worry for your safety, the safety of your family. You will soon receive some men at your home who will protect you. With gratitude, with gratitude Roberto. It's probably over here then. And considering it triggered a cutscene... I'd say it's right. Scusa. Uh, uh. Sure. Show me what you can do. Shit. Be quick, Salvatore. Pacenza, pacenza. Okay, where's the other guy? Got a Molotov. Oh geez, there's someone still back there. I knew there was someone else, but I couldn't I didn't know where they were. Oh, 
Yeah. Oh. <sighs> he almost lit himself on fire. I thought there was like a health thing oh, right over here. Salvatore, stay back. I'll deal with him. Here. Get him before he gets me. Get him. Get your first time. Come on. Presto, there's Semina Yisfiri. I know. Whatever you're saying, I know. Police? The police are behind us. I don't think they know where we are. Uh, okay, we're good. Salvatore, where do I take you now? Home. And where is that? Where home? Uh, six and nine four. Okay. Let's go. That health is real low. Yeah, I, mean, I thought I was gonna die there once I uh, came out. I thought the, I knew there was another guy there. Oh, we gotta go right. I knew there was another guy there, but I thought I could run up to the car for cover. But then he he ran out and shot at me, and, and I was out. I didn't, needed to reload, and I didn't know that. Oh, it was a mess. But we made it. Doesn't matter how you beat the mission as long as you beat the mission. There's a cop up here, but we're all good. We're not wanted anymore, so. Knowing me, I'd probably will end up like hitting the cop or something stupid.
Tony, devo dirti una cosa. Al nostro prossimo lavoro penso io alla casa forte. Hai capito? Ci ho quasi rimesso la pelle in quella villa ed è tutta colpa tua. E impara almeno un po' di italiano per rispetto della nostra patria. Ah, è come parlare al mio cane, lo so, ma Cristo, dovevo dirlo. Non farlo mai più. Mai più. Ok, ok. Uh, sure. It's a very detailed map, which makes it not so boring to drive around on. There's always something new to look at, and here we are. Good night. Night. Chapter complete. Visiting rich people. Well, that's going to do it for this episode of Mafia Definitive Edition. If you enjoyed it, then leave a like. Thanks for watching, and until next time, so long, everybody.